Hey guys, it's Katie of Love Sweat Venice, and today I'm giving you a five minute no equipment crop top workout. This is perfect for all those cute dresses and skirts where you wanna rock a crop top, whether you're heading to a wedding or walking down the aisle. We're not doing any standard crunches in this workout, but you are still gonna target all of those abs and feel every single inch of them. So we're gonna start in a forearm plank, your arms at an 11, on the ground, hips are low. Find that nice, strong posture first. Push your heels back, your gaze is down, neck and spine are long, belly pulls in tight. We're gonna alternate knee taps. You're gonna right knee tap, left knee tap, right and left. This is gonna hit those lower abs like nobody's business. Really, really defining those abs, helping get rid of any belly pooch so you can feel so good in those crop tops. And tap, 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 good. And breathe. Plus you get a little full body work here in a plank, anytime you're in a plank, really. Tap it, out, good. Let's do eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and last one. Drop to the knees, sit it back for a moment. Coming onto your booty. You're gonna place your hands on the floor, almost think like a tricep dip. So hands are on the floor, you're gonna lift your hips, and all you're gonna do here is squeeze your abs to lift that knee in, give it a little crunch, and tap it down. Lift up and tap. Marching here, keep your gaze up, use those abs to pull the knee in, and try to set your foot down as lightly and as gently as you can. That's gonna keep those abs working. Good. And squeeze. You go fast or slow. Pull it in. We have eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Exhale, release. Come onto your side for mermaid crunches. These are my favorite. Feet are gonna come slightly in front of you, so you're in a really, really, really wide V. Roll back onto the soft spot of your hip. You're gonna lift your legs up, bend the knees to pull and crunch in, extend and lower down. Up, in, out, and down. If it's too much to lift the legs together straight, you can go straight into that pull in. Otherwise, up, in, out, down. This works those obliques, so bringing the waistline in, which we all love, and also giving those nice lines and definition down the sides of your abs. Up. Let's do four more on this side. Three, then we'll switch it out. And two. Last one. And switch sides. All right, same idea. Find where you need to be on this one. Lift up, pull in, out, down. Good. Feel those abs working, oh my goodness. Squeeze them. The more you can focus on the muscle you're trying to work, the more it's gonna work for you. And that's what we want. So you get that definition so you can burn the calories and feel amazing. Down, up, squeeze in. Woo! And in. Down, up for four. Three. Two. Last one. Exhale, come on to your belly. And actually come into a full plank right here. You're gonna take right knee to your left elbow, step it back, and switch. If this is hard on your wrist, come to a forearm plank and just drive those knees in, opposite knee to elbow. Slow to start. And if this is comfortable, we're gonna take full mountain climbers. Switch in, in. Little cardio at the end. Finishing off those abs. Come on, you have eight, seven, six, five, hips are low, three, Two, and one, exhale, relax. All right, those abs are feeling it right now, but I want you to do three more rounds for a total of four. But this is a perfect workout to do anytime you just want that extra little push right before you throw on your crop top to help you feel extra strong, get that definition, pop in, and feel so good.